to declare what I see. Okay. With a uh, with Dr. Suwane. Dr. Suwane, I see. I don't want to keep my son. 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 I don't want to keep my son.
Ika malam minggu Dr. Ndu Kumete Ngum Tanawa Lain Lini E Mount Zion Connection And today Ngzon Tulela A segment Ye bizonge Health Awareness E Ning Kolelege Bazalwa Ne E Yona Le Metis Ngi Funding Es Ngi Isi So Na Yung Zoy Tula Nge Es Ngi Isi Kota Ngzo Zama Na Kona Ukfara Izulu Ya Bo Guze Ya Bo La Baba Ngang Bamba Ge Kaleni Babu Ye Bezu Guti Ngi Kondukti Ngi Mangi Shop Ngi Kshoyo Ok so bengi tu sabani project, that's why I prepared the presentation. Ni kote nzo kuluma giona, angaz mama fikiwe yuguti. Singa i distribute, sakuwa bata nduguti, ba bena yule information e bengi compile ile. But basically, nzo kuluma nunga kona mtlange is basically local over factor tina as avant best fazane. So it's just a short awareness topics. So so kulumanga yako is under women's health. So kulumanga breast cancer awareness and cervical cancer awareness, and any things we figure because it affects songe in a global pandemic is the COVID nineteen. Ni ganyan ug vaccinator and a little bit of information kula bumb sampe abangazi coming from someone or seven zana yu COVID like every single day. Gibona bantes pele la yabo be e yiba pete yu COVID. Uh, so the first topic of Sakuluma Ngayo is breast cancer, and what we're going to cover is who is at risk. So, we should go to Oba, and if I'm going to go to Oba, I'm going to go to Oba, and 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 I'm going to go to Oba, so that means umma no mukoko who has had breast cancer or ovarian cancer before. If you have a relative who has breast cancer or ovarian cancer, you are at risk. Are you guti uzo itola, but you are at risk. Umma umuntu e at risk, ugushu guti lo muntu fanele abe aware. Uguti impause breast cancer, zi vela ganja ni nuguti lo muntu fanele ashe zi checka so that Umanga bezi kona lezo impa umuta kwa zugeo cheka ayo shola and ayo ayo tola early treatment uguze inga spreadi ngo kushesha ipres kenza. Yazo waga langit. Yes. Bese ege abang ya bantu that are at higher risk are women above the age of 50. Okay. And kulabo also aba postmenopausal. Ogushugu tige ama period wako osuwa ase pelile. Right, God, while you are still using internal hormones, even during the estrogen, no matter the progesterone, low mood, you at risk of getting developer a breast cancer. And then, what can I get? If you have a condition, a belly, they could possibly develop into a breast cancer. Easy for injecting, or not easy for, but a condition that can be associated with it is in terms of get ductal hyperplasia. Is in terms of bizegi. Eh, i lobby la hyperplasia na kona uloko gushoguti uma uzizwa uneskata ebelin unga kazi mshampe usinage before no mesa ndukvela no ma esa kate si kona kota esa shinch right kota we'll talk about that kwa impao okay so impao that you need to look out for when you are looking out for ipres cancer is like I said iskata esisha esebeleni no ma esise kwa pain right Ma and also umagone skaka es dala es kaluk shinch es kaka es es kaka es shinch ayo es kaka es si either it's growing bigger norma it's getting harder right so anything anything that changes like a woman es kaka for him yeah I got a a kaza go club and then all of a sudden go back longo or si kaluk inaga kulu or si kaluk kula si bas kulu those are the changes that you need to look out for oglande la yo okay is if Ibele la costa to change in size or in shape. Yes, okay. Then also, if kubakona it discharge a pumaya from the nipple, also that has never happened before. As kulumi gengo muntu o ngelisayo, as kulumi gengo muntu kulelwe, and as kulumi gengo muntu o se skatin, because it discharging enzi la glezo ikati. But sengi shogut umuntu o ngapandli wa glezo ikati who notices a new discharge is inge zimpa o glezo. What can you do as a mutual spazana to to take care of yourself, okay, and to be able to detect these changes? So there are three things as ngai zenza or that we can do to detect breast cancer early. The first is to be aware. Panele na zuguti impa uzai breast cancer zin angitengi kazi ziazwaka. 
Then the next thing is, as much as far as you need to know Mzimbawa Kunoguti, who examine Shaganjan. And as no more, who call no Mutogewa, Cheluguti, a press examination, Yanzoanjan. Niawa, and it's a press exam. Give one of them, Lavang Guzi can. Would you like me to uh, explain how it's done? Okay. So, I wish I could have. Can I have a volunteer? Just one. Thank you. Okay, so Miss Anda is going to be my uh, model for the for the demonstration. So the first thing that you need to do is make sure you have a flat surface. So let's pretend you have a flat surface. There's a flat surface, okay? The next thing that you need to do is put your arm behind your head. So, Yes. So you're going to put your arm behind your, your head, ube ulele pants, right? And then with your other hand, you are going to, you're going to feel your breast, right? So your breast, sorry, your breast, you break it up into four, kanji, angit. So from the top, so ibele lako, it's not just lelbele elinga, you know, of your chest. Ibele lako, ala la is fubin, pezu. So that's where Lizoe Gakla can appear, right? So Ukala from Pezulu just under Lil Tambu, Lil Gwizu on a clavicle, and you do circular motion, right? So Uye Tlaganje, Uye Tlaganje, Uye Tlaganje, Kumutka down, back up in the middle, on the nipple, and back down on the side. So you keep doing like this, all the way down, all the way up, and down. So that's the one. Way last test or you check local sugupega e gak a corner or ongazis. The next thing that you do is that you you palpate noma utinta in those four corners, right? So you just make sure uzela a koluto nangala u make and make sure that nase kwa pen lia kotla gali kwapa because ne kak la zinga form and a corner kwa pen up 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 until into the armpit and down to the side under the breast. You need to make sure with na corner we are. You are test that to make sure that aziki gag. And then the next thing you also need to make sure is that ume pam, you can relax, thank you. Ume pam goes bugo, upalamise both your arms, ubo nuguti, ume amabele ako, because usually vele we have amabele etu, awa lingani, nam, vele. But if there is a big discrepancy or a big difference in the size of your breasts or in the way that they hang, that is also one of the changes that you can look for. Thank you so much, Ms. Ayanda. And the last change that you can look for is. Ukshinja wes kumba, pezu wes kak, loko sikbiza nge, skin dimpling. And it looks like angaz no manige ya naga i orange, but na ma dimples around the top, kubanja, nes kumba sak. So those are the things that you need to look out for, and things that will alert you. Guti fanele uyo testa, e kliniki, and ike, according to what your clinic offers, besen kubege la pambi. Okay? So that's the one thing. Awareness, self-examination, you should be doing this as often as as you possibly can and as often as kuvuma. Then the second thing, like I said, if there's any changes that you are worried about, the second thing you can do, uya ekliniki to be examined by a health professional, either unesi, no mutogotela, uzo wazuguksiza. Then the third thing that um, can be done is a screening mammography. Basically, it's an x-ray yebel. Right, a that looks inside the belly, but the structures are corners, is all right. No matter how many cuts, a bone, a gall, a flap, it's not so hard. A from by your hands, okay. In South Africa, they recommend you go to Montreux Fazane, find a toilet, a mammogram from the age of 40, at least yearly from the age of 40 to 54, and above the age of 55, at least every two years. This is just to screen. Uwenza shaw uguta ziki katla ezna zwaka li e kona ebelin. Does that make sense? Okay, and then we're gonna move on to cervical cancer. Okay. Um abantu ba yaz ngai cervical cancer. I sometimes feel like I a kulun yo ngayo ga kul. No? No one knows about cervical cancer. Okay. So mutunje mangiti cervix and niazu with e in the cervix. Okay, I'm going to tell you guys. I'm looking cool, magnina. Ninga understand. Uba no yazi. You go to Isevix. I in kalang pam selisant. Ogu shugu to everybody else. I gaya zi Isevix. Go to in. Cause I'm full of cars. I'm going to say vehicle cancer. I'm even gaya zi go to Isevix. I in. 
Angeza ma? Isbeleto. Yes ma. So i cervix i ingwe nye isbeleto. So ukumutunje yon isbeleto unayo i cervix. So i cervix is a structure that is at the top or it's, it's at the bottom of isbeleto setu but at the top of our vaginal canal. Right? I lento le evulega yo guze abo mtu metetile ingane inga pezulu la. Iyo ni cervix afane ni vulege uzi nga nizalega ngezi. So, si ibiza ngo mlomo wesbeleto. Ok. Lo mlomo wesbeleto, unga afflictwa pae i cervical cancer. Inte so klokla ngayoge is what causes cervical cancer, who is at risk for cervical cancer, i mpa uzayo, and unga itola ganja nugu tuna i cervical cancer. Ok. So, i cervical cancer, ibanga wa i triwane kibizu wange HPV, or human papilloma virus, okay? Leli kriwane leli is largely sexually transmitted. Loko kushuguti, nano mubani who is sexually active is at risk, especially umabenga isebe nzisi kondom, to get infection with HPV, a virus, right? But just because you have this virus, agu ushuguti, you can get, you will get cervical cancer. I cervical cancer ibangwa umangabe le virus lena uitola, and inga chitegi ilu kipas ipe sista. Kwe ma cells, omlomo, wesbeleto, right? So this means with infection inga kikirishegi, basically. Kwe inga kikirishegi leo infection, ama cells, kwe lukunjani, kwe kumlomo wesbeleto, start to become abnormal. And then a cancer can develop. Ya zwaga. So that means wukuti, wongu mtu anga itoli HPV infection, but not everyone ona yu HPV infection can, will get cervical cancer. Right? So, okay, who is at risk? So, jenga wabang shilo, all women are at risk for cervical cancer, and all, especially all women who have been or are sexually active. Right? So, unga itola from a single partner, or unga itola if una ma partner ama ningi. But it is more common unga itola is cervical cancer kwa bant bes fazane who are over the age of 40. Na kona kwa bantu bisfazale who are HIV positive, it is also more common because you are immune, 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 immune system ya kute uba weak when you are HIV positive. So it is also more common ke magunjalo to get cervical cancer. And also uma umuta epe mage, it also increases the risk of, contract, of developing cervical cancer. Okay, so ii mpao cervical cancer. First of all, muntu e na cervical cancer anganga bine impao at all. So that's why it's important to go to we must do ama screening. Nzo wakaz. Nvago wako. Nvago kutaz ama impao. Then the next thing is a very offensive vaginal discharge. Okay. So gushu guti vele sinawama discharge as a band misfazane bati. Le it's a very specific one. It's a one that is very, very strong, offensive. Vile yo guti njomu tume ngeena e rumin weaz. Oguti, mm-mm, konokshaya mans. It's a very, very strong, and if you've smelt it before, you will never forget. <laughs> it is very strong, uh, and it's the, it's the kind of discharge, Oguti, even Abanya Bantu will tell you, Oguti, mm-mm, konok, konok, kon. So, not lokok chwa ilegile, right? Another sign is if you have irregular or heavy bleeding. Uma umuntu velo moyes katini, awuko regular, and you have heavy bleeding, then it's, it's very challenging to pick it up. But if umuntu or regular mo yes katin, and then all of a sudden, uba irregular or uwapaga kulu, that's also one of the signs to look out for. Umangabe umuntu asfaza anoka te wakre taga ma period and you start bleeding. That's also another uh, sign to look out for as well. Um, and the zinyegi mpao is weight loss, ukatala, uh, pain also, another thing and that a lot of women don't talk about is pain on penetration, right? Ogushuguti, this is during sexual intercourse. So when you have pain, particularly on penetration, I don't know if that makes sense. Mm-hmm. So particularly pain on penetration, that is one of the signs that Ms. Fazane don't usually tend to speak about, but that's one of the signs of uh, cervical cancers, when you have pain in your pelvis on penetration, okay? So then I just made it a big point, Lana Uguti, because it is so common, Uguti Muntu Esfazane, it's totally HPV infection. It's important, Uguti Muntu Esfazane, a screen, Jalo for E, cervical cancer. Does anyone know who is screen again? Just shout it out. Yes. <laughs> That's exactly how we do it. 
and uh, yeah, so a pep smear is basically a test. La corner ni sitata a sample of ama cells uh, from umlomo espeleto, and we send it off to the lab to see what ama cells are normal or are abnormal. And depending on the report is itola yagulebu, then kubegela pambili from there. So you decide. So you decide either uzogwa is it small enough for gutunga keeper, like just lesos cartless corners tola gele. Or if it can go as far as ukipis beleto, depending on how advanced the cancer is. All right. So in terms of your pep smear in South Africa, but we should have a pep smear after the age of 30 at least three times in our lives. So when you're 30, you should have a pep smear. Better when you're 40, another pep smear. And when you're 50, have a pep smear. Ideally, a pep smear umunga was afford a good private. So this is the government recommendation. But if you are, can afford, it should be done yearly, especially if you are a woman who is sexually active. Whether you have one partner and it's just your husband or what, you should be testing at least once a year for e e pep smear. Okay? And if you are HIV positive, even more often, because like I said, the risk increases. So as it risk increases, that's how aggressive you must be in terms of your screener to make sure you can deal with it in the least invasive way possible. Yes, Waga? Okay. So, Enzoklinangakoge is to speak about uh, COVID-19 and the vac vaccination. We all know about COVID-19. We know Wuti Impauza Iini. And we know Wuti. Yeah, okay. what I want to just chat about is particularly the vaccination because I know that there are a lot of people who either have misinformation about the vaccination or who don't really know much about the vaccination, right? So what I'm going to talk about just kafushane is what it is, how it works, and who can get it, right? So a COVID-19 vaccine, like any other vaccine, can actually get a show of hands. Who has ever gotten a flu vaccine? Yeah, we say we flu season, not only vaccine. Okay, so I want you to understand that that because the COVID nineteen vaccine works like how no other vaccines work. What that means is that kutata ingwenye yes yekri one, aikri one elonge pilai, but ingwenye yekri one le akutwa gani zinto zako ne lepo kwenziwa i vaccine. I vaccine ngum sebens wayo is that i trainer amasosha omzimba. Uguti agwazo recognize the ikriwane before li the likudi sega cool. Right. Jango gobana kusonke sa watola ma flu vaccine if flu sa itola go tang it. Kotwa ego tole ni flu a yi be severe. Right. So the point of the COVID nineteen vaccination is to train wama social zimbawe tu. Uguti masa se tlanga na nekriwane le langem pela nga pan lil pilayo. Our immune system can recognize it ngoksha. CBC now, my social say rate to okay. Langu, go COVID 19, Gilo, no COVID 19 pay. Mazi come with COVID 19, Giacuma mean and Gialwa nai, right? That's what it basically does. And the point here, COVID 19 vaccine is not to prevent infection from COVID 19, but it is to prevent severe disease and death from COVID 19. You are more likely to die from COVID 19 infection than the vaccine. The vaccine has not been proven to kill or to cause disease in Abantu that, get vac that got vaccinated, right? Does that make sense? Does anyone have questions? Aikimbo's. Okay. No, Sengi Shuguti, as a person who has dealt with COVID-19, it's very close to my heart because I see people who come into the hospital with COVID-19 unvaccinated, severe disease, they need oxygen, they need ventilation, and of a lot of them, unfortunately, pass away. So the whole point of the vaccine is to make sure, Guti, even if you get the disease, it's not severe, it's like a flu. You know, you get the sore throat, the fever, the chills, but you don't need hospitalization for oxygen, you don't need hospitalization. Okay, mama. Gabonga doctor, Bing Boozer, Uguti doctor, Uma Ube Nai Covid, you are positive. Now, does the vaccine help obtain Bustega Masosha still? And what are the dangers in case Kunama dangers? Thank you. 
Okay, that's a very good question, Mama. So, if you have gotten COVID-19 before, now call Nama Social Mzimba. So, Tlape, that's actually even a, a better vaccine than the vaccine itself. Because, Mama, Nama Social Mzimba, I train against particularly the local one, right? So, that means, Uguti, when you get it again, you do have a form of protection. But it is still recommended, Uguti, once you have gone out of that phase of being positive and being symptomatic, or kombisim pao, that you do take the vaccine as a boost as well, right? Uh, the side effects, being south of Kazuguti, the side effects, yeah, your COVID-19 vaccination that people have reported is fever, chills, uh, some nausea, and abanye kwabantu abanama elejivele. Because the vaccine QA with a component in it, and a lot of people are, who are allergic to common things tend to be allergic to I'm a component egg and now call now if you're a person you're allergic ne vaccine you can also get an allergic reaction to the vaccine so labo bandu uh recommend but i don't know if they're going to get a, a different kind of vaccine because it also depends on the stock is in now so tina we only have the j and j and the pfizer like a south africa but the moderna sma liga so i don't know what the solution will be for labantu aba now i'm allergies does that make sense yeah, so every time, really, when you do get a vaccine, some people can get a, what we call a seroconversion illness. What that basically means is lezo bengi kaza fever, chills, nausea, that is your immune system, isi luamanje leleong ngye vaccine, and creating amasosom zimba that are designed to fight the COVID-19 vaccination. But lezo impao shouldn't last more than three days, okay? And for anyone who's interested in taking the vaccine, a... Eh, I can also be a testament. After I took my vaccine, they usually recommend, Uti, you take your vaccine, upumule for the rest of the day, upuza manzi, and you must religiously take ipanato. So, ipanato yako every four hours, two pills every four hours, upumulu puza manzi. I remember I was on call the day I took mini vaccine, yam, so I was up the whole night, but still, I was side effects. So, literally, you just, I just took my panados every four hours, I am as much as I could while I was on call. at all. Another side effect that is very common is just pain at the injection site. So labak jova corner, it does tend to get quite painful. It's not magnetic. I put a, a coin on my arm. My the coin fell off. It's not magnetic at all. It doesn't cause any muscle spasm. It doesn't cause anything that you've seen on videos. I can attest to that.
days where I could not pronounce even one single word of English, but now he has anointed my lips and he sent the angel of God to put the fire, the cold in my tongue so that I will speak English because we are going to another level where we're going to speak English only. We can clap hands for Jesus. Hallelujah. What a day today. What a day. This expect is supersede the expectation, yam. And I just wanted to say, Kalangokbonga, Wena. Can Kuluma now? Semang Fiaba Figi Eligat in Babu Mishwin, Yabona Lelu King in Nia Zayon. Ibonila Gates. For those who paid attention, but only the best Amen. I just want to say thank you for you being here and for you being a part of my life. I just want to say thank you, Banda. They be busy. Oh, Mam Tiliz. Oh, Mamungo, Mangazi, pressure, they be tolo zanelli. Not they be carish and no coco is pusha like a move of coco. But Lavazo run by a yaz in Dabai Pilila in Shabin. By a yaz in Dabai Zeli Mounds on Carnation. Now, what sometimes a woman zima to lay good to Waga, got a cell bonus earlier approach, but they pushed Nibona Lulusugulunja and it's because of them. Amen. So, in Tanuk Bonga, no Baba Ute Maguin, I'm trying to be ready to shy Lily Pass. What in Aguba Sugule, no got things of any corner to give any support that you want. So, San Luis Bonga. All the brothers are balan. As I want to be one and tell us, Siba, Siba Kulege, no brother. Oh, what's about wing a man like Obasia Bashia? Oh, Mr. Great, and as a Mukona in. Yes, it's Balin, no brother. Maybe Hambang a move at Sinas or Hamba, but that's Tell Woods Baboni, Behambang a Pambil, Amen. Betty take over and then Hambas Hambisani, Eka Mendigachi. So I just want to say thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. In Sandu Bonga no Spiwe, Uputuami, no Bekon and Amsanje, Eka Mendigachi, Susia Bong. And then he pointed Landelayo. So Silana gave us a line, he pointed Landelay from Kulumangal, Salutua gave us a line. Salutwa. <laughs> Salutwa wa fetu. Gwenze gini desi ngagaza si ibone, si tabange. E ngagazi ngene tlizwe ni omundu. So kushuma gwenze galogo, gwenze guzani. Sasa. Eish. Eish. Asikali. Sakala pela ngalo la suku. Abanye ba kolabsa. Abanye ba kuleka. Kona sabuye sati haibo. Ukulu nyiwe pela. Uncle Uncle Shilwa Tigaz is in Punyogi, Sabuya Saik Oka Sabana Man. Amen. So I just want to say thank you, Guti and Giva Panga Banga Pelilu Amanda Bazalan. As the Katase in a Luto, if for Cassia Tigle and Tessienzai, go about Sakons, Abazalan, Sakons, I get Sakons exane, Sakons of Sugalango, eight was washout six weeks, shall you say, Sikonza. I was a concealer. 